Fear eats the soul, and fascism eats the soul of every country where it takes hold. By breeding fear and hate and division and brutality, this country voted overwhelmingly for love. This country voted overwhelmingly for compassion. We voted for the rights of people who are different to us, and we voted for them to make their own decisions. The Irish people did not vote for hate. in this country. They continue to attack those who have a legitimate mandate. Okay. Hazel Chu is Irish. Yay! And she has a democratic mandate. The fascists peddle the most ridiculous false mythology of what it is to be Irish. And yet, they have the gall to talk to us about unicorns. Anyone who knows anything about Irish history recognizes that we are a nation of immigrants. It is profoundly hypocritical and dishonors our history and the struggles and successes of Irish people all over the world to attack immigrants and refugees who live here now. Those of us who believe in democracy, we must continue to strive for what is best in us. We must not be torn apart by fake divisions. We must continue to honor our democracy, honor our common humanity and our decency. We must say no to hate. Violent words lead eventually to violent, despicable actions. Freedom of speech is a right, but each and every one of us has a responsibility to use our words properly. We must not provoke hate. Those who provoke those who pour bile on our streets and on our social media must be held accountable. We urgently need to have more rigorous hate legislation to address hate crimes and social abuse on media. Yeah. Tormenting the vulnerable in society is not strength. Strength is upholding the rights of the most vulnerable. Courage is not picking on those who are different to demean them. Courage is standing up to intimidation. True freedom of speech is not abusing that freedom to denigrate others. It's using it to increase our mutual understanding, to bring light, not fear. Democracy is about choice, equity, and our responsibility to each other. So beware of those who only want to empower themselves to disempower others. Beware of those who dress themselves up as anti-corruption when all they do is corrupt the truth and make empty noise. Disrupting residents here on Barrow Street. Harassing people going about their daily work. And abusing people horrifically online. We want, they want to keep us distracted by using far-right tactics of blaming and shaming minorities and vulnerable groups. We are wise to their tactics and we reject their fear-mongering. They want to keep us distracted from addressing the real causes of inequality in our society. The real challenges we face with housing, homelessness, healthcare and climate breakdown. Science is real. Vaccines work. Facts matter. And diversity is strength.
extremism, racism, homophobia, transphobia, and sexism. We will not be distracted from building a better, fairer, more humane, inclusive, and equitable Ireland for all who live here now and in the future. We are a people moving towards love. We are people moving towards compassion and kindness and peace. And we will not be dragged back into the division and the acrimony of the past. From this street of the River Barrow to every street beyond today, we say no to fascist propaganda. Today, we say no to intimidation and baseless lies. Today, we say no to hate.